Hey guys, what is up? It's Brickson here today, and in this video, I'm going to be doing a video on my mock for Brickspiration Studios 100 subscriber mock contest. Um, this is something I just finished creating today, and I was having a lot of troubles with this contest. I didn't know what to build, and I wanted to build something new. I didn't want to use an old video, just because I feel like it's just better that way. So, um, yeah, after several trial and errors and several hours of building, I finally came up with this. This is a combine, if you couldn't tell, which you might not be able to. Um, I did the best with the pieces that I had, um, but I figured, you know, it's the end of harvest for most people, um, still harvest season, um, but we're done combining at least. And this is designed to look like a New Holland CR960. If you don't know what they look like, um, last time I was combining, I took a lot of pictures of the combine, so um, here are some pictures. So hopefully that gives you a better idea of what I was trying to go after. Um, but really, this um, took me a long time. I started off finding the wheels that I think would work best, and you know they, they they're the best that I could do. Um, then I also have the header section that comes off, and the little prongs on the front of the header, which you might have seen in the video before or the picture before. Um, I'm just using some girls, and then the track or the conveyor belt that leads up to the um, actual combine itself is there. Um, again, it's supposed to look like New Holland, so it does have some New Holland, um, kind of like hints of logoing. Um, it's connected pretty simply, but, um, you can have it move up and down. Um, just doesn't very connect very well. Um, but anyways, um, I guess if we move our way up, you can see the cab here is, you know, just made out of some clear bricks and, um, slopes the railing here I'm um, just using some studs because it is such a small scale and I don't know what else I could have used um, the ladder here is just another grill um, I feel like the side of this thing looks pretty realistic with the New Holland logo and then the like the framing the back is where I kind of lost it um, the wheels just look super tiny um, the chopper here is it's pretty good for what I um, for what I have to work with um, the back is okay because it kind of curves in, but yet it curves out like that way too. So it was really hard to make with Lego. The railing I feel like is pretty good. Um, I just wish it could have fit more yellow, but it would have been a lot taller and a lot longer. And I mean that wouldn't be that bad. I want to make a bigger version of this eventually. Um, up here is where the engine's supposed to be, and then here is the grain tank. Um, I just put some grain in there um, so it would hopefully look better and we are starting to fall apart as you can see here I did use some slope pieces so it kinda looks more realistic but the auger um, which does look fairly good can actually fold in um, just cause it wouldn't be able to fit underneath of the grain tank so that's kind of a bummer but I mean if you're just gonna have this for like a decoration which I will um, I think it does the job pretty well this here is kinda like that little spot on the calm mine that the real ones have see in the picture and then the other side is nothing too too special but um yeah that is it for this video I think um, thank you so much for watching this video and good luck to everyone at that enters Brickspiration Studios mock contest I was kind of late on this but um I think mine turned out pretty well I will have this on display but um yeah so thank you guys so much for watching this video really hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys in the next video